metronidazole, also known by the trade name flagell. Metronidazole is indicated for the treatment of intra-abdominal infections, gynecologic infections, skin and soft tissue infections, bone and joint infections, central nervous system infections, septicemia, endocarditis, amoebic liver abscess, and peptic ulcer disease. Metronidazole works by inhibiting DNA and protein synthesis in bacteria, causing a bactericidal effect. The therapeutic classification of metronidazole is an anti-infective, an anti-protozoal, and an anti-ulcer agent. Special considerations for nursing include that metronidazole may cause a disulfram reaction, causing excessive nausea and vomiting in patients who also use alcohol while on this agent. Infectious status should be assessed before and during treatment, and if cultures are required as part of the anti-infective regime, they should be obtained prior to starting metronidazole. Monitoring of neurologic status, including paresthesias, weakness, ataxia, and seizures, as well as intakes and outputs and daily weights, are all important while on metronidazole therapy. Metronidazole may also alter liver enzyme testing. There have been case reports of metronidazole also causing a discomforting metallic taste in the mouth. It is important to note that metronidazole is only active against strict anaerobic bacteria and has little to no effect against aerobic organisms. This has been another episode of the Nursing.com MedMaster Podcast. My name is John Haas, RN, CCRN alumnus, and I want to give you our free download of the 50 most commonly prescribed medications. To get that free download, just go to nursing.com slash 50 meds. That's five zero nursing.com slash 50 meds. We love you guys. We want you to succeed. That's why we provide clear, concise, and visual supplement for nursing school and the clinical floor. We love you guys. Go out and be your best selves. Happy nursing.